Welcome back travelers. Today's video is going to be a short and to the point type video. It's all about reasons why your hacks and glitches may not be working. First and foremost, the two items you're using may not be compatible. I don't have a great example of this, but I do know if an item is floor locked or ground locked, that means it may not work with particular glitches. A floor locked item is an item in my terminology that only works inside the house on the floor or outside on the ground. A ground locked item is an item that can only be placed outside. There is of course a workaround for this, which includes the red winter lights present, but it was only available during the winter lights event. Hopefully the event does return and you can get these presents if you didn't get them in the previous year. Secondly, you may not own all the land on your plot yet. Not having unlocked all the sections of your plot using writs from City Hall means that particular glitches such as out of bounds are not going to function. But it's not just limited to out of bounds. Glitches that require you to put items on other items also may not work if you don't own all of your plot sections. Third, your keybinds may not be set correctly. You need to make sure that in your control settings, Placement manipulation confirm move has a key to selected for it. I use V, but without that, a lot of hacks and glitches are not going to work. On the switch, you have to make sure that multi select has a button associated to it. While the switch has limited glitching possibilities, you can use the gourmet dessert bowl hack, which is included in the I cards above, but without this key bound correctly, it will not function. Fourth, you're trying to sink an item too far into the ground. If you sink an item too far, it's going to teleport to the front of your plot when you leave and come back. So if you're going to do any building by sinking an item, make sure you sink the core item first, leave, come back, see if it's going to teleport to the front of the plot, and if it doesn't, continue building. Fifth, you're not taking breaks. Literally the best thing you can do for yourself when you're trying to make a hacker glitch work is take a break. This is not gameplay advice, this is personal advice and you can take it or leave it. But if you're sitting at something and pounding your head against the desk, you are not going to be able to think of ways to change it to make it work to what you want. So please do yourself a favor, take a break, do something else and come back to it later. Sixth, which seems really weird, but I swear to you it's true, your outfit is blocking the glitch. Particular hats especially will make it impossible for you to participate in a glitch or hack you're trying to do. So change your outfit and try again. Seven, the glitch you're trying to do requires two or more people. If you're trying to do a glitch or hack without following a tutorial and you don't understand why it's not working because you're trying to use skill sets you already have when it comes to hacks and glitches, it's probably because the person that did it had multiple people come over to their plot or they're using their switch and their computer on two different accounts, maybe two different computers to get this glitch to work. So look up tutorials first before you, again, bang your head against the wall, trying to get something to work that you really can't do on your own. Eight, it was patched out. It's as simple as that. If you're following a hack or glitch video tutorial and it was posted over five months ago, there's a real solid chance that it's just not possible or it's possible, but you need additional steps to make it work now. The best thing you can do is make sure to read the description of the video, read the comments of the video, and make your own comment with as much detail as possible to see if the creator can help you as to why it might not be working. Nine, your frame rate limit is way too high. A lot of the glitches, especially the ones that require you to overlap items, need to have a frame rate that's a lot lower than you currently have. So go into settings, change it from what you currently are down to 30 or 60, see if that helps. Just don't forget to change it back when you're done. Please remember that if you are not a person who can use hacks or glitches, maybe you don't have the patience, maybe your hands don't let you do it, it doesn't mean that your decorating skills and your home are any less beautiful than anyone else's. If you're anything like me, you go through periods of thinking that your builds just aren't good enough and no one's gonna like it. But if you're having fun in the game, that's all that matters. And I know that's cliche, but it's true. So have fun with your builds, even if they're completely vanilla, because some of my favorite ones in fact are. And a disclaimer, of course, is that I don't know every single reason that your hack might not be working, but these are some basic ones that I hope help you out. 
And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you feel like it, but most importantly, have a very magical day.